Exploring with Miss Gordon. Sit spots. Hey explorers, Miss Gordon here. I want to tell you guys a really cool nature story. A couple years ago, I box walked out to my sit spot really, really early in the morning. And I sat in my sit spot for a really long time. It was out just watching the woods. I was using my deer ears, using my owl eyes and my dog nose. And then all of a sudden, this raccoon came from out of nowhere and she walked right in front of me, probably like 10 feet in front of me. And I was like, whoa! And then right behind her came her baby. It was so cute and adorable. And I would only have been able to see them because I was being so quiet at my sit spot. I love that nature story because I felt so connected to the world around me in that moment. Now, to give you a little bit of background, in that story I talked about something that you may not know what I was talking about. It's called a sit spot. What's a sit spot? A sit spot is a special place that you go where you feel safe and you can watch nature around you. So that may be in your front yard, it may be in your backyard, it also could be at a window. It's a place where you can observe nature and sit quietly and calmly. I would love to show you guys my sit spot. Come follow me. about the things around me. Sometimes I'll sit and I'll experience things that are amazing, like that raccoon that, and her baby that walked in front of me. But sometimes I sit here and I feel like nothing happened. But every time I leave my sit spot, I feel calmer and I feel happier. Your sit spot is one spot that you go to every time you want to learn about nature. This week, I challenge you to go out and find your sit spot, your one special spot where you can go out and sit and learn about nature. It might be on your porch. It might be in your backyard. It also might just be by a window, but pick your one special spot and send me a picture of it this week.